ready to open the hood, use tool for the tutorials, and for car parts, the right idea is the Mr. Auto app. Easy, fast, and with better prices than on the website. For this operation, get hold of the diesel fuel filter that you will find in the video description. Turn your engine off, pull up the handbrake, pull on the bonnet release lever, and open the bonnet. You will then be able to see the diesel filter. Remove the electric connection by lifting the holding spot and pulling on the terminal at the same time. Then disconnect the first hose by pressing on the white coloured part. To disconnect the second hose, press the two green coloured parts on either side of the hose to unclip it. Extract the filter by pushing upwards, which should release it from its housing. Place the filter into a container to collect the liquid underneath. We suggest you watch another of our videos, how to make a collector for liquids. All parts used in this tutorial are supplied by our trusted partners. These partners also help us create as many video tutorials as possible. Check them out in the description below. Using a Torx 35 socket, remove the screw on the diesel filter cover. Remove the cover. Drain the filter. Separate the filter cartridge from the flange, levering it off with a flathead screwdriver. Remove the gasket from the central screw. Take out the robo ring which is located under the rim of the flange. Clean the filter flange using brake cleaner fluid and paper towels. Take the new filter. Replace the center screw gasket with the one supplied in the new filter box, taking care to lubricate the surface of the gasket. Lubricate the cover gasket and fit it in place. Take the new filter. Insert the new filter element, pushing downwards to the bottom of the box. Put the filter cover back in, paying careful attention to the position of the spur to be able to reconnect the hoses once the filter is installed in the right place. Then screw the screw back on the cover. Put the new filter in position. Start by aligning the lower spur on the filter, then the upper spur. Once in front, apply a downward pressure on the whole thing. This will let you to put it back in place. Reconnect each hose. As well as the electric connector. Pump the primer pump until it becomes hard. Operation completed.
Hi, it's Theo from Usetool. I hope this video has helped you a lot in your car maintenance. We would be super grateful if you could spread the word so that we can produce even more tutorials. Simply give us a like, a comment, and hit that subscribe button. It really helps us boost the channel and help the whole community. Thanks a lot and have a great one.